Throw, 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 throw it up. <laughs> Start twerking like Miley. Oh, yeah. Twerking like Miley. Don't pop it like Miley. All right, my peeps. We will be doing Temple of Ikov today. So, to start this quest, you will be in Artie, and you will be right here. So when you teleport, you end up here. You end up right here in the center. All you gotta do is just run west across the bridge over here, and right up to the pub. And you will be looking for Lucian. To do this quest, you will need 20 limp roots, a U long, a U bow or better. Uh, most people are probably going to use uh, magic, but at least you. Uh, light source and a knife. Right now, all we really need is the light source and knife, and we are going to start this quest and speak with Lucian, who is just in here. Talk to him. Important mission. I am a mighty hero. I require the staff. Uh, uh, oh no, that sounds like a laugh. And he will give you the pendant, pendant of Lucian, and then he's gonna disappear and tell you you gotta go into uh, Edgeville. I think he is. All right. So from here, you're right here. We are going to the temple, which is right here. So pretty much northeast. You're right here. You are going up here. Now you can run. I'm just going to teleport to uh, Camelot and run down because I think it's a little bit faster. But if you're right here. You're going right here where this little exclamation point is. So not too far. All right, guys, once you get here, run down the ladder over here, down these stairs, come over here to the end, use your knife on the web. There we go. Walk in here, get the Boots of Lightness, and you can wear them. Um, you can get uh, more than one pair, which I'm going to do. I think that they uh, respawn quick enough, so I'll come back as soon as I get a second pair. Alright guys, if you got your second pair like I did, then you're, you're good. Run back up the stairs. Alright guys, for this part, you need to be... You need to be below zero. Now I'm wearing a lot of, uh, uh, oh crap, what's it called? Graceful. I'm wearing a lot of graceful, so I'm light anyway, but you need to be below zero or you will die. You will fall to your death and die. So make sure you are below zero. All right, so put on your pendant of Lucian. Walk through this gate here. Run over here. This is why you need to be below because you will fall off the bridge and plummet to your death. Walk in here. Come over here and grab this lever. Alright guys, once you get your lever, if you are a lower level, you are probably going to need some food. Um, if you're a higher level, it might not be too bad. Um, I'm going to chance it because I think I'll be alright since I am a semi-higher level. But, so what you're going to do, if you do go get food, make sure you have the lever. Alright? You're going to use this lever on this little bracket. There you go. No, we're going to use the lever on the bracket. There we go. Pull it. All right, and now you. Sh oh, did I not go quick enough? 
Okay. And you're going to run through here. Alright. Remember, if you're a lower level, get food. Okay. So for this part, it's these spiders that will smack you. Oh, they're going to smack me too. So what you're doing is you are looking for ice arrows. And they are going to be in these little alcoves here. So you come here. Open the chest, search it. Nothing. Alright, go to the next one. Open the chest, search it. Nothing. Again, go to the next one. Open the chest, search it. Nothing. I would recommend, guys, you get. Uh, I don't know, 25 to 30 arrows maybe. Open the chest, search it, nothing. I'd say about 25 to 30 arrows. If you go to the end and you do not have enough arrows, which chances are you're not going to because I haven't even got one. So come over here. This is the last one. I'm going to check it. Oh, I got three. All right, so I'm going to run over here. So if you go through all the chests and you don't get any, you can hop worlds. So as soon as I get my arrows, I will be back. Again, if you go through all the chests and you don't have enough, just hop worlds. All right, guys, I'll be back as soon as I get uh, the arrows. All right, guys, I'm going to roll with 28 arrows because I think that'll be enough. Of course, watch me get there, and it's not, but I'm going to roll with 28, because I think that'll be enough. As soon as I get out of here, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, from here, uh, if you are lower levels, I would suggest you go get some food, range gear, stuff like that. Um, if you're not a lower level, because you'll be killing a level 84. Um, if you can protect, I believe you can protect from his mage attack. Um, he's a level 84. I think his max hit is like 8 or something. So if you're a lower level, go get some food and come back to the video right here. Or pause the video and then start. Uh, if not, then just run through here. Gonna run up here. Make sure we're on rapid. Come over here. Uh, search for traps. Disable them. Pull the lever. Run over here yonder. Go through this door, which should now open. Yes. All right, come over here, try to open this door. Gonna get a little cutscene. This crazy loco is gonna come out. Give us an astounding blast. And then we're gonna whoop his ass. Beat him up, beat him down. Get a little magic attack going. I have to pick up my arrows. We got this. We got this. I'm not even going to have to pick them up. Maybe. I think we got it. I think we got it. We're going to do it without having to pick them up. Oh, we did it. I don't pick up anybody just because I want them. Okay, guys. Now you have to do a, another bank trip. So I am going to... Heli to Camelot because that's going to be the closest place to uh, getting back there. Run here to the bank because you need your 20 limps so we can hitch a ride with a witch. Alright, so we'll go here. Oh, no hacksaws for you. Okay. Deposit that, this, deposit this, deposit this. Let's take out another agility pot. Let's deposit these. T 
take them back out. Release that. I'm going to bring a couple food with me just in case. I don't think I need any, but just in case. Alright, guys, again, go back to your right here at the bank if that's where you went. Run back to right here. Alright, I'll see you when I get there. Alright, guys, now you are going to be picking a side here. I am going to side with, I, I think I'm going to side with Armadillo. The Armadillies. So I can get the Armadillo pendant. Um, there will be other guides out there if you decide to side with Lucian. But I'm going to side with Armadillo. So I'm going to run through here, run through this door. And this is one elder. Just gonna plop us to the other side. Boom! Cakewalk, baby. Cakewalk. Okay. Run over here. Uh, take off your pendant of Lucian. Do not put it back on. <laughs> You're siding with Armadale. Don't put it back on. Run past that room. To this great training spot for lesser demons. Grab this shiny key. Run back up. Past this fantastic training area. Right here. Push wall. Talk to the guardian of Armadale. Do not attack. Uh, what are your kind doing here? I believe. Who are the Maharajababa? Did you say Lucian? You are a fool. You're right. It's time for you for my yearly bath. Ooh, holy water, I'm melting. You have been cleansed. Okay, I'll help. Alright. Put on this armadillo pendant. Now there should be... Push this wall. Run over here to this ladder for you that need to get out and you will be right here which is you're right here so run to a bank if you need to otherwise you need to go to Edgeville so I'll just keep recording because we're almost done use my little uh, glory here run 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 alright Run over here. You're pretty much going to this house right here. This house right here by Edgeville. And then the house to the east. That's where you're going. That. Run over here. Because now we're about to whoop Lucian's ass. Because we started, sided with the old armadillo. Armadiles. Armadillians. Open this door. Come in here and open up a can of whoop ass on Lucian. Bam bam! You have defeated me. You're damn right I defeated you. And there you go. Quest complete. One quest point, 10,500 range experience, 8,000 fletching experience. We are now at 114 quest points. Alright guys, if that helped you, which I hope it did, uh, like. Leave a comment if I could have done anything better. Not that I can really change it now. But uh, like, share, whatever you got to do. It all helps me out, guys. All right. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks, my peeps.